Hey, what's going on everybody? My name is Michael Adams and I served in the Marine Corps from 2016 to 2020. Uh, I was stationed in Tornado Palms and I served with 1st Battalion, 7th Marines. I did two tours to Iraq, uh, one in 2017 and then again in 2019. Right before my second deployment, so January-ish, uh, 2019, December 2018, I decided that I was going to get out of the Marine Corps uh, after that deployment. Um, so I got out of the Marine Corps in January of 2020 and it was great those first uh, couple weeks because I you know, was doing everything I wanted to do for the past four years pretty much. I was living the epitome of being in the first Civ Div and it was great. And then after a couple weeks, stuff start, started to die out and that euphoria of being out went away and the reality of being out set in. And the reality of it is, is for me, it sucked. And it still sucks. I'm still working my ass off to get to where I want to be in life. Because when you get out of the military, you lose the chow hall, you lose the barracks. You know, your barracks is where you drank, you hung out, you did everything with your friends. You worked there. And I mean, for me, I was in the infantry, so we worked in the barracks and we played Xbox all day. But you don't have that anymore. You don't have insurance anymore. So you have to start doing all that things on the outside of the military. But you have to pretty much find a place to live, get those insurance, you know, be able to feed yourself, get a job, go to school, figure out what you're doing with your life. And I had an idea, I already knew that I was gonna get out and go to school and you know, I'm eventually gonna get into real estate investing and I'm going to school for business. So my plan for that part is working out. But then the part, the more mental aspect of being out, the sense of purpose, to see your friends, and just kind of really feeling down, that's the part that really got to me. And it came to, an, uh, to a head when I started seeing all my friends graduating college and I felt so left behind. And I, you know, let me realize that if I have all this negative energy for this, let's put it towards something good. Let's go out and help other veterans. So, what this channel is gonna be about is pretty much to help other service members transition out of the military through vlogging and through my experiences and my mistakes. Because if I'm having these thoughts and I'm having these questions and things like that, I'm sure as hell somebody else is. You know, so I want to be there to help somebody, somebody that, you know, be somebody that's another person to turn to and be like, oh, well, this Michael did this. Well, let me try this. Maybe this will help me. Another reason for this YouTube channel is I've been watching a nonprofit. It's called the Hometown Battlefield, and its two purpose, main purposes currently are to raise awareness about veteran suicide because I really feel like unless you are a veteran or you know somebody personally in the military or who's a veteran, the idea of veteran suicide just doesn't really come to mind. And most people think that, oh, Veterans, they just need to talk more, you know, and that's not the case, you know. You got to give veterans time and they will talk when they want to talk. And I think that's a big thing that a lot of people don't understand. Um, and the, the second purpose is to is to offer financial support for, for families affected by veteran suicide, whether it's paying for funeral costs or helping pay off any debts that veteran who had committed suicide may have incurred over their lifetime and being able to take a lot of that financial stressors off of the family so they can have time to grieve and really focus on their family at that time being. So I'll have my Instagram linked in the description. It would be, it would be a lot if you guys could share this video and really spread the word as well as leave a like and subscribe. Um, and I'll try to post a couple times a week and really get this thing going. If you wanna help out with the nonprofit, once again, my Instagram will be linked in the description and go ahead and message me. So uh, I'll see you guys around soon.